Poor people have been suffering for a long time, the last 30 years under Reagan. There's a wonderful book, Greed is Not Enough, by Robert Lukács when he wrote in 1982. It was true then, it's even more true now. So when you look at Ryan, you've just seen the, the ultimate logic of a market-driven uh, a vision that has very little concern about poor people and working people. And in black communities, of course, you've got what increase in unemployment even as it, the employment, unemployment dropped slightly for everybody else. Of course, not a mumbling word from our president. No, not at all. He's running for office. He don't want to get too close to black folk, right? Secondly, you've got a prison industrial complex that continues to escalate and intensify in a very ugly way as the war on drugs continues to send so many folks, 72% of them going to jail are there because of the war on drugs, soft drug offenses. And you've had depression-like levels of unemployment and underemployment for over 30, 35 years or so. And so there's a real sense in which the, uh, the, the suffering that we were talking about is even more intensified in black communities, brown communities, and let us never forget our indigenous brothers and sisters. Enjoy Grit TV? Want more people to see it? Well, we are making our program available free to public television stations coast to coast. If you would like to see our show on your local public television station, please give them a call and ask for Grit TV with Laura Flanders. Thanks.